dear. The fireman's around. Running at like full speed. <sighs> what are you doing? No, 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 no. Oh, oh god. Yeah, no, you don't. Because you're too slow. Keep running, keep running. <laughs> I died in the fire that time. God. Yeah. Fox is face palming. Jump properly. There we go. Pull it up. There we go. Run through. Jump. Jump. Bowler. That looks like it's going to melt. Maybe not. Okay, Fox, that's one for you. Pull it up. to do this. Ow. Am oh, I meant to just stand there until he's thrown that fireball? I think that's probably the case. So yeah, up here he can't hurt me at first. So if I just stay out of the way? No, it is going to hit me. Okay. So I have to kind of get him to shoot it in the direction of that tree and then get Fox to move me out of the way. So we pull it over and then we move it. No. Hmm. Not sure. We have to, we're definitely going to have to control Nuna to, to pull it. So I think we pull it over. He shoots. Switch to Nuna. Fires, misses. No, that's still gonna kill me anyway. Hmm. I right, put it vertically then, straight up. Over in the middle here. That can't fall on me then. If he tries it. Ha ha! No, that didn't work. <laughs> it definitely homes in on me. How do we do this? Can I trick it and make it fall in your face? No. Hmm. Plot thickens. I, it seems like I can't go down the bottom. Because if I go down the bottom... Oh, hello. That's staying down now. Oh, God. No, I'm dead. No, I'm dead. Oh, hello. No, I haven't made it fall on his head. Oh, God. What am I doing? But if I fall down, then I'm definitely dead. Okay, so I seem to need to weaken that tree to the right, and once that gets destroyed, then we can continue onwards. Or more to the point, if I do that, then he uh, starts falling to his death or something. But... Okay. Oh, 
can get one more. Maybe. Okay. Put it over a bit more. Missed completely, sir. Come on, you need to knock down this big branch. There we go, that should do it. That should do it. There we go. Right, bowler. Bowler, quick. Nice. That's for killing my fox, you bastard. I don't know it should look like it. Now where do I go? Down the bottom? Manslayer. The recurring type of character in Anupiak stories is the Manslayer. And the Manslayer is kind of this bad guy. And I think really what's at risk when the Manslayer comes into story is the livelihood of individuals and the whole community. And so the Manslayer is really used as a way to say, don't act only for yourself. Always hold the community in your heart. Often time in these stories, there is one person that will stand up. And, and what this humble person will represent who faces that manslayer is a return to order, a return to true living in the community. And it just takes that one person. It could just be that one person that can help to change everything. Because everyone wants to live a good life. Everyone wants to have a good community. He approached this spot and saw that for some reason the blizzard seemed to be originating from a small tundra meadow. Very strong blizzard now. I'm not sure if I can go down this hole. The answer appears to be no. <laughs> Jesus Christ, came up a bit too early there. What is it? It's probably like some kind of thing snoring or sleeping or something. Oh God, what is this?
I need to bow to that, don't I? Oh, don't fall off. There we go, perfect. Oh crap, there's rocks there though. Oh god. I'm not really sure what I'm meant to be able to do over this side. Ah, hello. There we are. Alright, down you come. Oh god. <laughs> the wind scumbagged me. Okay. So I'm probably going to need a wind assistance here. <laughs> fell to me deaf into the spikes. Oh dear. What is actually up here? Oh, oh crap. In fact, yeah, what's down here? More to the point. I'm guessing nothing. It's just where I can land if I fell off. So... Definitely nothing over here, is there? There's a few bits and pieces, but no. Definitely meant to go this way. Maybe it's just bad luck. down but I don't know why I'd need that yet. Can I jump on this bit? Yep. Does the wind blow left though? Yes. Uh, Weird falling bug. It returns. I think that's as low as this gets. So Right, you're on it this time. That's good. And then I guess we have to jump right the way across the other side. There we go. Okay. What's this? A rope? No, that didn't work. Missing. That one worked. Okay. So another one. Can you 
pull it. Oh god, you fell off. Why did you fall off? Silly girl. Right, stay holding on this time. Okay, so we need a leftward scale. There we go. We reached another checkpoint there. Um, is that a wall that we have to... Yep, I fucked that up. <laughs> I think there's a little ice pillar in the middle there that we can't jump across. So if I just pull that up then... We should be able to connect to that. Oh god, I've jumped in the face of it. Actually, there's a second one here as well. We might want to pull that down a bit. There we go. Okay. Left. Yeah. Let me pull you up. As high as up as you can go. And jump. Oh, oh don't fall the way down the bottom. Come on. God damn it. And left, jump. Okay, upwards. Wait for the right gust. There we go. Yeah, this time it lets me jump on it. There we go. Okay. The gusts seem to have stopped, which is good, because I can jump up here and I can jump across that bit. So now what's going to happen? Oh god! I have to jump on his pickaxe. Oh god. Okay, so there is a leftward gust. Can't seem to jump though when he's moving it, which is a bit awkward. There we go. Oh god, am I trapped? I thought so. Oh! A spikes at the bottom. And the fox dies as well. He's a spirit now, he can't die. Right, how are you meant to do this then without getting crushed? Like that. <laughs> oh, it's not that the fox is dying, he's just doing his little face palm thing, so I hit the at the bottom. Jump, 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 jump. Oh, come on. Why can't he jump? Jump. Am I banging my head on the ceiling or something? Let's just wait until it's done its little bonk. And then we go down. Yeah, there we go. Maybe I was catching my head on the ceiling. I couldn't get enough jump. Oh! I didn't realise that spike was there until it was too late. Okay. Right, so wait for that to go down. Jump up. Then we can jump. I'll nearly cock that up. Let's wait here a second. The stabby spikes go down. I can jump up here. Oh, no, I can't. Hmm. I might have to watch that and not just understand where that's moving. And jump. Okay, so it's in resting. Goes down, comes back, rockets up, and then it's in resting. Now we go. 
Ah, Nelly. I, mean, I might, might need to jump off that a bit quicker. 